Hi guys, subject of discussion is Cyropentol. It is an anesthetic drug used uh, worldwide and still use it just because of few countries uh, removed this drug from the daily use in anesthesiology center. So Cyropentol is a sulfur analog of the oxybarbiturate pentobarbital. It is formulated as sodium salt and presented as a yellow pale powder in vial so its vial contains also sodium carbonate and nitrogen in place of air just because uh, these measures are designed to improve the solubility of the solution by two mechanisms one of them is uh, sodium carbonate reacts with water and uh, result a strong uh, strongly alkaline solution with pH 10.5 also air contains small amount of carbon dioxide and where this is to be uh, present and react with water it would tend to release some bicarbonate and hydrogen ions which in turn would result in a less alkaline uh, solution Cyropental use, of course, anesthesia, status epilepticus, but uh, preferable is lorazepam. Sedation for uh, surgical procedures of less than 15 minutes just because of uh, rapid recovery in a one bolus dose and decreased hallucinatory effects of ketamine. A dose of induction is from 3 to 7 mg per kilogram. If we are going by mean, it's like 5 and patient of 70 kilograms, it will be 350 milligrams induction dose. But maintenance dose is like half of, of this or even less. Side effects of uh, Cyapental is uh, everything decreasing. I, I can name it less. So let's go with cardiovascular system. Cardiac output is decreased, stroke volume, heart rate, and total peripheral resistance is decreased. And for this reason, a patient can encounter some refractory tachycardia. On a pulmonary system, you'll see some effects like bronchospasm and laryngospasm by decreasing the alve alveolar diameter. Central nervous system also is exposed to some effects like decreasing blood flow, blood perfusion, and uh, even intracranial pressure. And at the same time, reduction in oxygen consumption, which, which is very important as a neuroprotective uh, effect. A decrease in, uh, in a total peripheral resistance, heart rate, cardiac output, decreases the glomerular filtration rate as a result of decreased blood pressure, but as compensatory effect, antidiuretic hormone will increase and will retain water. It is contraindicated in porphyria because it is an inductor of enzymes, enzymes that produce porphyrins. Uh, some kinetic points are uh, when it is less uh, protein binding, it is more active. So, to be active, uh, cypental have to be. Uh, uh, free or unbinding, unbounded. So uh, one dose it's great just because of uh, rapid side rapid uh, effect of the drug and rapid recovery. But if you uh, are uh, administering a lot of doses, it will be redistributed to the tissues and will accumulate, and it will have a prolonged effect from the releasing lately from tissues which uh, it accumulates. It is a P450 inducer and it can induce metabolism of many drugs and decrease action of duration. And important uh, thing about accidental intraarterial injection of Cyropental as uh, it have 10.5 uh, pH uh, when injected in the blood, the blood have 7.4 and result in a less water-soluble solution. So it can form crystals and 
precipitate and become uh, wedged in a small blood vessel to produce ischemia or even occlusion of uh, peripheral vessel like capillaries. Uh, one of the signs will be uh, ir irresistible pain. So what is the treatment of this? You have to introduce in the same uh, intraarterial cannula which was inserted popoverine or procaine it's uh, local anesthetic analgetics and anticoagulator uh, I also want to tell you that uh, Cybental is used widely in many countries it is used also in a pregnant or in a labor and in many others that can be used so thank you for your watching hope this video is useful for you and if you like it you can subscribe and follow me in the next videos have a great time